We are at Cape Camping and RV Park in Cape Jardu. And we are here for one night. So it is a pull through. I think it's 50 amps. Let me go check. It is 50 amps. We got water, we got sewer. Even though it's one night, I do like having sewer because I take showers in the evening. And Walter takes showers in the evening or in the afternoons. I never know. But I like taking a shower in the evening. Sometimes I like taking a shower in the morning and in the evening. Uh, according to Walter, we are spot on left and right. So we don't need to put blocks down. We're not disconnecting. And it looks pretty leveled here. So we're not in some weird hill angle. And it looks like the bed is, yep, the bed is leaning down. So our head is not opposite of our feet. Oh, okay. We're going to set up utilities and it's two o'clock now so I can take a nap. I ate a little bit too much at Cracker Barrel. It's the first Cracker Barrel we've seen on the road and we had, I had fried chicken, their fried chicken dinner. Today's dinner is provided by the Fantasy and we're having salad. We have Hawaiian, pineapple, pepperoni, and sausage. And here's the group that got to eat first. And then here's the group that's still starving. Yeah, I really like this park. Too bad we're only here for one night. It's a more of a transition stop to Memphis because it would, would have been a really long drive. Now the reason I really like this park is that there are no trees between the sides. So if you look, there are no trees. So it's wonderful. You can get satellite reception at every site here. So for RVs, this is the perfect place for reception. Our Starlink, we did not put the flagpole up for it. We just stuck it in the back of the truck and it worked very well because there are no trees blocking the sky. Again, the park has 50 amp water in, water out. Really nice. So would I stay at this park again? Oh, definitely yes, I would. All right, we'll see you down the road. Thank you for watching. Bye.